The sudden death of Cradle Fund Syndrome Berhad CEO Nazrin Hassan on the eve of Hari Raya Idul Fitri is now being treated as a suspected murder. Police have reclassified the case following a forensic investigation report by the Fire and Rescue Department, which cited suspected foul play in the death. Slango CID Chief Senior Assistant Commissioner Fazil Ahmad confirmed this on Monday. It was reported that traces of petrol were found in the deceased's room following a lab report by the department. On June 25th, 11 days after Nazrin died with burn marks on 30% of his body, Department Director General Mohammad Hamdan Wahid said the probe carried out jointly with the police had several new inputs and certain samples had been taken to its forensic lab for further investigation. The 45-year-old died of what was initially believed to be smoke inhalation after his room caught fire at his house in Mutiara, Tamansara. The fire was thought to have occurred after his mobile phone exploded while charging. Nazrin apparently complained of a migraine and went to bed after taking some medication. He left behind wife Samira Musafa and four children.